Earlier that day, I had received a call telling me that Jesse Helms would be attending a rally for presidential candidate Bob Dole at Catawba College. We arrived on campus too late to get into the rally, but I did manage to stop a few people as they were leaving. So, um, what about Helms? <laughs> what about Helms? What do you think? I'm a theater major here, and because of his uh, views on, like, the arts and stuff, not just that, but, I mean, he's, like, obviously racist and homophobic and stuff like that, and I'm black, and this is my boyfriend, so I don't fit in either of those categories. <laughs> do you think he represents most of what North Carolinians feel? No, I think more on the conservative side of North Carolina. Well, North program. Carolina, I think, in general, I haven't lived for, neither of us have lived for that long, mm -hmm. but uh, what I've seen of North Carolina so far is that it's pretty like that. It's pretty much like that. It's like what? In general, I mean, think of our town first. Think of yeah. Something. I mean, of course, there's some radical spots. You're always gonna have radical spots in places, but in general, I think it's like, if, at least here. I don't know. I've been really traveling a lot. I can't really say North Carolina in general because I haven't been around, but here, it's pretty like it's pretty like, it's pretty conservative. Yeah. yeah, we had like a, a KKK march here, like beginning of the year. Yeah, maybe? in October, I think, or something like that. Are you guys involved in the gay group here? Yeah. He is. I'm not. What's it like? It's not very active. It's really small. It's small, but we're met with a lot of resistance. Resistance, yeah. I guess because it's a uh, conservative Christian school and a lot of the kids that come here. This is a reli religious school? It's religious it's affiliated. affiliated with uh, UCC. Two and a half years later, on October 7th, 1998, Matthew Shepard was murdered by two young men because he was gay. He was tied to a fence pistol-whipped, and left to die on a cold Wyoming night. He was 21 years old. This is the only footage I have of Matthew. It isn't fair. <laughs>